the abandoned building. <laughs> This is your wake-up call. Prepare to die. Welcome to Trivia Murder Party. Those free vacation coupons you received in the mail were a trick, luring you into a game with deadly consequences. Only one of you will survive. I'm running a hotel and killing people. I've achieved work-life balance. All right, first question. What's this cute little guy called? Use your device to answer the question. Time's running out. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, time for consequences. Welcome to room 101. I hope you like magic tricks. Make a space in this box to hide yourself. I'm not sure if there's oxygen, so try shallow breathing. Choose now, or I'll choose for you. It's time for the volunteers. Okay, take this cool sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your sword through. Fun fact, when I found this magic prop in the basement, it was full of rabbit and dove skeletons. Come up! On guard! I wonder if that'll grow back. Don't worry. Remember. Dead players are still players, just more see-through. Keep playing and you just might steal someone else's life force and win the game. Let's try another one. When is American Thanksgiving? Almost out of time! <laughs> Who picked... this? The rest of you who are still alive... I want to show you something. Salutations! Welcome back to the killing room! Let's play with dice! Roll as much as you want to add to your score. I'll kill the player with the lowest score, but go over 21 and you die instead. And don't forget, if they roll a skull, that adds one to everyone's score. Honestly, it's mostly just an excuse to use these cool skull dice. Your last chance to sneak a few extra rolls in. You busted. Thank you for getting blown up. It makes me so happy. Moving back into my parents' old murder hotel is just a temporary thing until I figure out the next step in my career. I'm not going to turn into them. Let's keep moving. Who invented the first electronic computing machine in 1822? Oh. Time's almost up. 
Follow me. Let's get our math on. Do as much math as you can before time runs out. Everyone else will be playing along. If one of them does better than you, it's punishment time. Let's go. I thought this would have been more fun to watch. Only a couple seconds of math left. This is what they mean by aftermath. We're here! When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question! My criminal profile says I'm reserved, a perfectionist, and emotionally detached. Aw, that's really sweet. Which of these could be my Myers-Briggs personality type? Almost out of time! Who picked... this? It's time! Ah, the spirit of giving! You each get $500! Give some of that money to your friend! The person with the most cash at the end will die. But if you give to someone and they have $800 or more, I will kill you instead. Begin. Let's see who gave what to who. Well, that's a lot of money. Too much, really. So you're safe. But an overambitious investor, on the other hand... I wrote this next question just for you. If you get it right, I will punish everyone else. Which animal is the loudest? Time's running out. And the correct answer is... Did you get the question right? Aw, oh, tough break! Come with me! Are you ready to fall? In love with my new minigame? You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. Hmm, someone needs to pick which slots are death zones. Go ahead, everyone else. Choose a slot to make it no bueno. Hurry along. Okay. Let the games begin. Pick a spot to drop from. I'm sure everything will work out for you.
I made this board in shop class. Don't blame me, blame gravity. <laughs> Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Congrats on making it here alive! But can you escape? I'm going to give you a category. Roll Doll Books. Tap each answer that fits the category and then press Submit. Let's see the right answers. You advance one space for every correct answer. You're a little bit closer to escaping! Oh wait, did you think it was going to be just you? Aww, that's cute! If a ghost catches up with you, they will steal your life force. Then they can escape and win the game. Here's everyone's next question. And ghosts get a third choice to help them catch up to you. Time is almost up. Cruciferous vegetables! Lunchables! Behind you! It's only darkness! Food be there for people! Time is almost up! The darkness approaches! Vegetables and tubers. You can't outrun that ghost forever. Mark Twain characters. your friend! Better get away fast! You won't be forgotten, whoever you were. One of the seven chakras. Time is almost up! Another life force swap! Wrestlers from Netflix's Glow! Plague the Egypt in the Book of Exodus! You're better than I thought. One last trap. You need a perfect answer for your final escape. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. Time is almost up.
I know I should just start the game, but I can't stop thinking about how there are probably alternate universes just like our own, but with one small difference, like, uh, I don't know, maybe their names are all spelled forward or something. Wild, right? First question. How many years are you celebrating at a semi-centennial anniversary? Use your device to answer the question. Time's almost up! And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, follow me! Welcome to the Killing Room! Let's see who has ESP! Type in an answer that fits this category. Everyone else will answer too. And if anyone matches you, you die. And I do mean anyone. Answer time is coming to an end! One of you didn't answer! That's unforgivable! Anyway, let's see what everyone else did. Well, I guess mind reading doesn't exist after all. Did I say that out loud? Let's try another one. Here's a thought I often have while gazing at my garden bed. What makes carrots orange? of you who are still alive, time for consequences. Welcome back to the killing room. Ah yes, tattoos. My body is the canvas of your nightmares. Or for unicorns. Give me a new tattoo by drawing on your device. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, harder. Ooh. 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 I'm so excited about my cool new look. Now vote for your favorite design. The artist with the fewest votes will oh. die! <coughs> Vote already! Uh. What did we decide? You should really consider using a stencil next time. I think it's pretty clear what I have to do now. I was raised in a family of hotel-owning serial killers. I never really fit in. I always wanted to kill people in other places. They never really got me. Oh, I should tell that at a Moth Story Slam. Let's keep moving. What process causes a decomposing corpse to lose internal heat? Almost out of time! Who picked... this? <laughs> Everyone.
Everyone is wrong. It's time. Oh good, it's my money pile. Take as much money as you want. But, take the most money or the least money, and you'll be sorry. Enjoy the mind games. Stop stalling and pick a number. I'm excited to see what everybody took. The most and least greedy really messed up. We're here! When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question! When were windshield wipers invented? Oh. Time's on the stop! <laughs> Who picked this? I want to show you something. Another dice game? <laughs> I know, I'm like obsessed with dice. It's real simple. The player who rolls the highest will die. But we've got some help to make this more interesting. You have an extra die that you can give to whoever you want to make their odds worse. A little too even-handed if you ask me, but whatever. Roll the dice! The player with the highest total dies. My money's on the player with six dice, am I right? Roll the, the dice don't lie. <laughs> Let's try another one. What color is the outside of a J. Aradale pumpkin? <laughs> Time's running out! Who <laughs> <laughs> picked this? It's time! There's nothing more fun than fogged up mirrors. The ghost of my Aunt Mildred loves to write words on mirrors. Pay attention to her unique handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will all the safe players. Draw a word on the mirror to camouflage Aunt Mildred's. Start writing on that mirror. Pay attention to the words as they appear, and try to spot my auntie. So many convincing words to choose from! Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote, or you die! Do the right word now, or you die. <laughs> Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? <laughs> eh, Aunt Mildred would like never say that. It's time for you to join my Aunt Mildred. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive. But will you be the one to escape? Here's your first category. Locations in Game of Thrones. Tap each answer that fits the category, and then press Submit. Time is almost up! Let's see the right answers. Old Testament books! Time is almost up! U.S. Monopoly Streets. Never Married. Fall behind. Here comes the darkness. Boat related occupations. Time is almost up. Getting pretty close to the exit. College football goals. Kind of a gimme. It's not over yet. If you want to break through that barrier, you'll need a perfect answer to this question. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. You have to get all the right answers to escape. Next question. Clouds. Time is almost up. You're not going anywhere. The tables have turned. Welcome aboard! I'm Chuck Hull, the ship's captain and MC. Grab your dummy and sign in.
Let's move it, people! Don't have all day. <laughs> Let's move it, people. comedians here's tonight's itinerary we're gonna write some jokes and then test them out on stage but first things first it's brainstorming time before we jump into the jokes let's do a little writing exercise to get inspired on your device you'll be prompted to write various topics like animals people or objects fill in whatever you think has a lot of comedic potential if another player uses one of your topics in a winning joke you'll get some bonus points Generate as many as you can. You have 45 seconds, starting now. You've got time for one or two more. Now that your noggin is moving at full steam, it's time to write some comedy. Follow the steps on your device to construct two jokes. If you haven't started your second joke yet, now would be the time. Time's running out, submit what you can!
looks like some of you didn't finish your jokes. Too bad. I hope you're a better crowd than the last one I performed for. They were all aboard. <laughs> but seriously, the jokes are hot and the sea is cruel. So let's welcome our first comedian to the stage. <laughs> Vote for your favorite joke now! Okay, up next! <laughs> Which joke was funnier? Vote now! Smattering of applause going. I got the cure if an idiot cure if an idiot. Let go, says eat a bed. And some credit to you! You know him, you love him, it's this person! Wally the I can't tie boo. Wally did boo ma.
tip of the hat to you. Let's keep things going for the next comic. And how about some points for you as well? Keep that applause going for our next comedian! <laughs> Let's keep it going for our next comic. Remember to say your catchphrase. Steve, <laughs> <laughs> set up. Let's see who's on top and who is scraping the bottom of the barrel. If you're currently losing, might I suggest writing funnier jokes? Just something to think about. sinking again. There's no time to write jokes from scratch. So, here's the plan. Let's rewrite another comics joke. You'll use the same setup, but we'll attempt to write... Okay, let's get to it. You know the drill.
Please, hold on to each other for safety, and at the same time, welcome back our comics! <laughs> Which version do you like best? A real clash of the titans!
who's won a trip with me off this sinking monstrosity. Thing. Welcome to the Dictionarium. If words were muffins, this would be a place where you make muffins. Check out this crew. Very nice. In the Dictionarium, you are responsible for making up and defining words. It's a team effort and also a competition. If you want to play along, join the audience by entering the room code. Let's get started. First up, I'm sending a slang phrase to your device. What does this phrase mean? Write down the answer on your device. Don't think too hard about it. Or, if that doesn't work, try thinking really hard about it. Submit your definition. Check these definitions out! Loading time! Choose the definition that makes the most sense to you, or that makes the most joy to your world. And remember, you can award bonus points to the ones that stole your heart. And the winning definition is... Now let's 
Let's do the same thing for the other phrase. Vote for the best one, my little melon ballers. Pick the definition that makes you feel groovy. And the winning definition to be immortalized in the dictionarium is... that matches the definition on your device. Round two goes fast, so type, type, type! Words. Choose the phrase that best fits the definition. This slang in a sentence. Write a sentence containing the new slang phrase. Remember, your sentence doesn't have to be beautiful for me to love it the rest of my life. At the end, submit your sentence now. Let's survey these sentences. Time 
to vote. And the champion sentence is... And now we vote! Wow! Fantastic entry in the Dictionarium! I couldn't have done it better myself! What a terrific entry in the Dictionarium! You should be proud! But now, let's see who got the most points! You are welcome back anytime. I just found a new word and it's dipped in chocolate and rolled in sprinkles and I want to eat it but I won't. The game that you are playing well the Sorry to interrupt your cryosleep, but I thought it worth mentioning that I, your digital officer during emergencies, or Dottie, have detected an alien biorhythm on this ship. And just as I suspected, the aliens uploaded a virus which is slowly deleting my program. I'm here to guide you through if you'd like.
I've determined that three of you are secretly aliens. Please look at your device and confirm your identity. Your device can tell you if you're human or an alien, but not the identities of your fellow players. Unfortunately, aliens will know who their compatriots are, so you'll be at a bit of a disadvantage, humans. By my calculations, you will have 18 minutes before I cease to be, so I'd appreciate it if you could figure out who the aliens are, and then push the button. You will be our first captain. Choose an available room and your desired participants. You have been selected to give your opinion. Answer the question on your device. Here's the prompt humans should have received. I expect friends to immediately text me back. Now let's see the results. Do any of these answers seem suspicious? We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. New captain, selected. Okay, let's get a move on. Pick another room and test group. There's less than 17 minutes. You have entered the drawing quarters. Draw the prompt on your device. Doodling with their doodling, hit the hurry up button. Humans received. Draw something poisonous. And discuss. We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. And the title of captain has been passed.
make it through this, I'm gonna make an effort to remember your names. Our first visit to the deliberation deck. Answer the question on your device. And the prompt for humans was... You're a modern-day Noah, but with a smaller boat, you'd have no problem leaving behind... Anything odd? here people so let's keep it going next captain you're on the clock welcome to the extraction room Will you isolate? There's still a lot of time left. Are you absolutely sure you got this right? Since this is our first time here. Now the non-isolated member shall vote. Okay, time to vote. The vote has to be unanimous. If anyone votes no, we'll have to go back to the main cabin. The vote has failed. All you can do is keep testing until you can all agree. Okay, next captain, you're in charge. Back again, huh? Whom will you isolate? There's still a lot of time left. Are you absolutely sure you've got this right? You only get one minute, so act quickly. Okay, time to vote. The vote has failed. Don't run out of button pushes, humans. Alright, you are the next captain. Please make this opportunity count. Another trip to the opinion hold. Keep your eyes peeled for any out of character responses. Let's see the human prompt. Nobody should acknowledge their birthday after the age of 16. Let's obsess. We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. Next captain, please. Oh, 
below. And that deliberation fountain, that ain't water. Okay, here we go. Whom will you isolate? There's still a lot of time left. Are you absolutely sure you've got this right? You only have 30 seconds. Okay, time to vote. The vote has failed. Don't run out of button pushes, humans. All right, you are the next captain. Please make this opportunity count. Maybe this is the virus speaking, but why aren't there any birds in space? Writing test initiated. Write an answer to the prompt on your device. It's worth mentioning. And here's what humans saw. I would consider myself an expert about... What do we think? We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. Why can't emergencies have calm alarms and soothing noises? Next, Captain. anybody out, but I think the writing pod is haunted. You wasted some valuable time there. Next captain, identified. Lucky, you.
Hey, this room looks familiar. Whom will you isolate? You only have 30 seconds. Okay, time to vote. Don't run out of button pushes, humans. All right, you are the next captain. Please make this opportunity count. I'm really over this whole glitching thing. Another trip to the opinion hold. Keep your eyes peeled for any out of character responses. I can't believe this is happening two days before I retire. Humans received the following prompt. I'm a cat person. Do any of these seem stinky? We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. Okay, you're up. Let's go. There's less than three minutes. You picked drawing? That takes forever.
these responses were worth it. Here we go again. Whom will you isolate? You only have 30 seconds. Time's running out, Captain. You'll forfeit your time. Okay, time to vote. I regret nothing.